Hey, welcome to another episode of Terminisms. We're going to break down another fight that's going to be in uh, UFC 99. One of the pre-fights, we may not see it on television, then again, we might, you never know. Depends on how quickly some of the other fights go, some of the main fights. <clears throat> We're going to talk about a um, difficult fight to break down, not a whole lot of information on either one of these guys. But uh, we're going to talk about uh, Stefan Struve and uh, Dennis Stoinich. Struve, 16 and 3. Stoinich, 5 and 2. 16 and 3 sounds a whole lot better than 5 and 2. But looking at the two fighters and looking at uh, what they've done and who they fought, no real big names except for their very last fight. Both of them lost their very last fight. Stefan Struve lost to uh, Dos Santos, and uh, Stoinich lost to Cain Velasquez. Uh, it's really close. I've watched a little video on both guys. Struve, really tall guy. Stoinich, though, um, a really violent guy. And a after looking at the two, I, I really want to give Stoinich the nod, even though he's 5-2 and two compared to 16-3. and three. But, you know, that's the big thing about records, especially for newcomers to the UFC. If you've had 13 wins against guys that aren't of top caliber, or you've had four wins against guys that aren't top caliber, and now you're coming into top caliber, and you yourself are top caliber, that record just really doesn't mean a whole lot. Um, the interesting thing, Struve has only two knockouts and 12 submissions. Hello, that tells you he's a submission guy. 75% of his victories were by submission. Stoinich, on the other hand, has two knockouts, no submissions, and three decisions. I'm thinking Stoinich ain't the best guy on the ground. Struve probably has the advantage on the ground. Stoinich probably standing up. Only time will tell, but on this fight I'm going to pick Stoinich. Please remember to go to Trumanisms.com. Remember to visit our sponsors who are just on the right-hand side of the videos. Also, if you would like to be notified when the next Trumanisms comes out, simply email Truman at Trumanisms, and I will make sure that you get emailed every time a Trumanisms comes out. Remember, we're going to post them all first on Trumanisms. Pre-fights, uh, at least for a while, we're going to be posting on YouTube. Post-fights only on Trumanisms. Also remember that I'll be watching the fights at Sam's Boat in Austin, Texas. Uh, great venue to watch the fights and enjoy them. And that pretty much sums it up. Also remember, if you are from Austin and you go to Sam's Boat and you see me, please say hi, let me know you saw me on Trumanisms. Until next time, peace.